Hello, my name is Steve Bowler, and in this video we're going to be taking a look at RIP version 2. Specifically within RIP version 2, we're going to be taking a look at how the passive interface command works within RIP version 2. And what we can see here is that we have four routers in our topology. Router 1, Router 2, Router 3, and Router 4. Now, Router 1 is connected to Router 2 and Router 3 via you know point to multipoint frame relay connection using its physical interface. So Router 1, 2, and 3 are connected to each other using their serial 00, zero interfaces and they are all in the 172.16.1.0 slash 24 subnet. Router 2 is the dot 2. Router 1 is the one and router three is the three. Also we have another network down here going to router four, the 192.168.14.0 network. So router one is in the one network for that subnet and router four is in the four is the four IP address uh, in the fourteen subnet. And again, these are all the loopback interfaces. They all have loopback zero interfaces respective of their router IP addresses. So router 1's loopback is 1.1.1.1 slash 24. Router 2 is all 2's. Router 3 is all 3's. And router 4 is all 4's. So what we're going to take a look here as is what the passive interface command does within RIP version 2. And what we're going to see here is that what the passive interface command does is that it, you know, it stops sending updates, you know, out the interface in which it is specified. So, first off, the passive interface command you can specify it globally, and it will apply to all of your interfaces in which you are running, you know, RIP on. Or you can specify. Uh, to run passive interface on a you know a per interface basis so you you would do like passive interface and then you know fast ethernet 00, zero or serial 00, zero or if you want to do it globally it's just passive interface default so we're going to take a look at its behavior and see what exactly is going on when we have passive interface enabled So let's go ahead and uh, get right to it here. So again, let's go into router one. If we just do a show IP interface brief, we have the connection to, you know, it's a serial zero zero connection. Let's go ahead and configure the loopback. I'm sorry, the fast Ethernet zero zero with 192.168.14.1 and that's a slash 24 subnet mask let's go ahead and do a no shut here uh, if I do a show IP protocol let's see if I have any routing protocols running here and I do and it's rip so if I do a show run pipe to begin rip you can see here that we have our gateways router 3 and router 2 as neighbors So we have version 2 specified, no auto summary, and we are advertising our network, 172.16.0.0. If I do a show IP interface brief, so we do have a loopback.